this week coming up against Oregon. Just trying to get everybody back healthy. You know, we got a lot of down people right now, but um, just trying to get everybody healthy and win this game. That's all we thinking about is winning this game. How much does the, does the veteran leadership like yourself come into play when, like you mentioned, you got people down and you got people coming in next man up, so to speak? It comes into play a lot because, like, now it's like you got people who are supposed to redshirt, not redshirt anymore, and, like, not really knowing the system. So, like, you, they're going to need your, that vocal leadership on the field. And, you know, just knowing that I got a freshman right here, man, I'm a three-year veteran, you know, he's going to be looking up to me, asking me questions about stuff, and even on the defense, like, looking up to people, asking people stuff. So, just got to... Take control of the game. Basically, our our leadership got our veteran leadership got to take control of this game. And if I feel I feel like if we take control of this game, we'll win. Your thoughts on Dylan? How he's he played a, played an excellent game. You know, he did what he could. You know, uh, once he got that first completion, he started getting in the rhythm. He started getting better as the game went. But um, I think if if we probably had at least one, well, if we would have had one more drive, we would have capitalized. I feel like we would have capitalized and won that game. But you know. Stuff happens for a reason, but um, yeah, he played a good game and um, he got his, he's building his confidence every week, so he's, he'll be he'll be fine. How about your confidence? My confidence, y'all yeah, know my confidence. Your confidence in in Dylan, though. You know my confidence in Dylan. <laughs> <laughs> my confidence is the same in every one of my teammates, no matter what, no matter who it is. Jack Smith can come in and start at quarterback. My confidence is still gonna be the same. Kalen can come play quarterback. My confidence is still gonna feel the same. It ain't going nowhere. No matter, I don't care what our record is. Even the last two games were losses, it looks like the Sparky formation is becoming more and more ineffective. What are your thoughts about that? It's easy work. <laughs> it's just easy. But, you know, people starting to adjust to it, you know, trying trying to adjust to it, you know. But, um, I mean, it's hard nose. that's hard-nosed football. Whoever want to stick their nose in there, like, like I said before, and try to stop us. But as you can see, when it's – Short downs, nobody want to stick their nose in there, so it's easy work, man. Hopefully, you run it a lot this week. This defense is suspect. You talked last week about uh, being a football junkie. You guys have faced a lot of 3 4 defenses this year. Oregon runs a 4 3. How does that present a different look to you as a back? Don't matter. It's easy. It's easy work. <laughs> it's another day in the office for me. They just got another down lineman. You still got to play football. Doesn't now, change it don't point. change. It don't change nothing if you patient at running back, patient at quarterback. You know they just got a. But Oregon's defense, they it's like it's like a basketball team. They got a lot of length on the defense, so it's like you know a lot of tall guys on the defense. So I mean, it don't really change nothing. It's just they just out wide and they got long arms and they can put their arm up in the air, back the ball down. It may change your gap just a little bit, but it's just another day in the office for me. It's too. It's too. It's easy. Like, when you've been playing the game for over 10 plus years, you know, it's easy. Every, it starts to come easy. And when you're a student of the game, not just playing football, just going out and, okay, I'm not about to watch no film. I'm just going to go in and just run the ball. No, when you're an actual student of the game, when you're up here, when nobody else is up here watching film by yourself, when you're up here at, or when you're at home watching film by yourself, or when your roommate is somebody on the defense and they're helping you read a defense and he's a veteran on the field, it's easy. Especially if my roommate is a DB and I, he's telling me when he rolls this way, it could be a cover three, it could be a cover three robber. So it's like, it's easy work. And when you're going against our defense, there's nobody in the country who runs the defense we run. And like, that's why blitzes and stuff like that don't really phase me because if you can pick up that defense, you can pick up any defense in the Pac-12, any defense in the country, honestly. So what do you see from Oregon on It's like a basketball team. They got a lot of length. On the basketball team, it's a lot of new faces, fresh faces on the defense. But you know, you still gotta respect everybody, but fear nobody at the end of the day. But uh, you see, man, y'all, y'all know what I, I, I can't speak on it. Y'all know what Oregon defense like. I'm pretty sure y'all seen it. It's y'all job, I don't know. <laughs> it's pretty funny to be, but yeah, I don't know, man. It's a Pac-12.